guys for checking the energy. This is for Scorpio. Sending you all love and light. Thank you for everyone that's liked, shared, or subscribed to my channel. If you have purchased a reading or if you've donated to my page, thank you so much. This energy could be masculine or feminine, so you guys place it on whatever side you need to. Happy holidays to everyone. what's going on here with your energy okay pretty soon we'll be in a whole nother year guys <sighs> happy new year to you guys all right so we have um beauty untamed free spirit of the mermaids uh spirit of the anchor solid investment stability um and we have Spirit of the Castle. So some of you are in your thoughts. You want that special person to come into your life. You're waiting on it, right? Uh, with the special person, you're thinking about, you know, what investments you guys are going to have. If you're going to buy a house, if you're going to have good uh, financial stability. You guys are thinking about this. Maybe something that you're obsessing on right now. Okay, you have two of cups situation here, right? So I have someone coming into your life that's going to be a two of cups. Somebody that, you know, you feel comfortable with. Someone that's the yin to your yang. Someone that you feel is your other half. Could have cancer in their chart. You're going to have a mutual attraction with this person. Um, it could absolutely be someone from your past, but I do feel a new connection as well. Okay, this is going to need to develop from friendship to partnership to happy couple, uh, proposal, engagement, blah, blah, blah. You know, I feel like something is coming in for you or someone is coming in for you that has that potential. Okay, Queen of Wands, you guys are looking strong. You're looking good. Okay, whether you be masculine or feminine, you're doing the damn thing. Take good care of yourself, right? You're warm, you're ambitious, you're exciting, you're assertive, right? You're living your life, you're multitasking all over here, all over there. You know, trying to be as optimistic as you can with your life, trying to be as organized and cheerful as you can, especially in this spirit that we're in right now uh, for the holidays, Okay, you guys are an independent, take charge type of person that is about your money and about getting yourself stable and your life in some order. Okay, and we have nine of pentacles. All right, this is what it is. You're in your head, you're imprisoned with thoughts. Okay, for some of you, you're trying to figure out what is going to happen in your life, how things are going to come in for you, what it's going to look like. But with this Nine of Pentacles energy, this is Virgo. This is financial independence. Yes. Okay. This is wealth, freedom, right? You guys may be a little bit more mature, but you're content. You're elegant. Okay. You're, you're doing what you need to do for yourself. You're, you're in fulfillment mode, whatever that may be for you at this stage of your life. Okay. Ace of Swords. Um, this is you being true to yourself. Okay. Libra, Aquarius, Gemini energy. This is you having sudden breakthroughs, clarity. Things are coming into you. People want to communicate with you because they feel like you're wise. They feel like you you give them good insight, okay? A truth may be uh, coming to light for you soon, um, and it's already something that you knew about, okay? So it's just going to be a sense of mental clarity uh, for you, okay? And you're going to need to make a choice of some nature, okay? Regarding a Knight of cub, uh, Cup situation, okay? With this is somebody coming, Aquarius or Pisces. This person was romantic with you or this person, if this is an old person, you had that in and out energy. Maybe this person was younger than you. Sometimes, 
you know, they, they were in and out, you know, they were unfocused, that type of shit. They maybe love bombed you, um, or could have gave you a lot of affection and then act like they didn't know your damn name. Or if this is not a person that you were dealing with, this could be someone that's coming in. However, okay. However, all right. This could be something that you really have to look at from a different perspective. This could be something that you really have to see if it's for you or not, okay? Because it could be that some, oh shit, I'm not taking these. It could be that someone's coming in and with them coming in, they may just be a little bit, um, what do I want to say? Uh, not rusty, but they could be new to this, okay? This person could be the type that usually dates a lot of people, likes to romance a lot of people, and they could be in a different frame of senses right now to where they want to maybe share you uh, with, with people that's close to them, stuff of that nature, okay? Could be a different type of situation, I was being called to get another card here, okay? So seven of pentacles is a is, is situation with um, things coming into fruition. So if you guys have been asking for something that's going to start off slow with that night energy, okay? It could, could go into uh, something more um, if you're willing or if you feel that there's a connection here and someone is worth your time and energy, um, this is what it is, okay? This is perseverance. This is planning. This is you guys uh, trying to get things into something that works for the both of you. If this is what you feel, someone also could have Taurus in their chart. Okay, so I'm leaving it here. I'm sending you guys love. I'm sending you light. You guys, uh, happy new year. Take care.